Hello guys, and another massive Nintendo Direct E3 week, much better than the other weeks I talked about. I actually also deleted one because it was another FNAF week, and I don't think anyone gives a crap about FNAF. And it also looks pretty fake anyway. So direct the opens of a trailer for the Doki Kong Country game. It'll be a 2.5D, OC focus on the Jurassic theme. We first see the return of Kremlin the King K. War to with Donkey Kong's 40th anniversary. It's called Donkey Kong Country Tra Tra Jurassic Smackdown. We're coming next August. We'll get Animal Crossing update, like, really anybody cares about Animal Crossing updates. We want the new games, guys, Nintendo, okay? Put that as a style drop instead, okay? Alex Kid DX will get a trailer. Fallout New Vegas report to the Switch, they've got a Tete. Uh, that game already was, they, that was, that's the way, so we got a Tete 5. Oh, uh, it's not the way, that was, they already, what, that game was confirmed yesterday, it was coming out in November, well, I don't know how that's a delay. Okay, because it didn't have a release date before. We'll see a full trailer of Bayonetta 3 with a new purple design as well. They said Bayonetta 3 will not be at E3, so that's not fair. This is vague already. Bayonetta 3 is confirmed not to be at E3. Double Heroes 3 will get another mention as well. Great Toy Ace of Toy Correction. Down Pro Remix to get some more things as well. Tokyo Toy Toy. It actually was sort of like the Sonic thing too. My goal for get a quick mention. Some things about Sonic Colors here, which will hear what Taco get new powers. Monster Train Port, Neo 20 trailer, Samus Dwayne Fortnite, no dudes are best way Prime 4. New 2D Metro game, then we have a Zelda anniversary segment here. Okay. Anniversary here. So, Crash fans, you're gonna cry over this. But Young Emperor is the next character in Smash Bros. Finally, Nintendo's adding another Zelda character. Finally, Nintendo's adding another Zelda character. Zelda finally gets another rep in Super Smash Bros. Bros. So, it's all over with Young Impa. They will also need to aid the Quarry DLC as well. The digital schedule for the HD will clear all improvements in the new Rebos. And now, these other items in Animal Crossing New Horizons, I could nobody care the crap about that. Except if you play Animal Crossing New Horizons, I don't, so I don't care. There. And some other things as well. And they saw the full trailer for the new Zelda Breath of the Wild 2 game. Yo, and again, they saw a Kobe game. Very random at the end. So, yeah, that's basically it for this Nintendo Direct E3 2012 World Week. I think Zelda Breath of the Wild 2 would be so at the end, because that was like the big game. But I think, oh, I think they're gonna, oh, it's gonna be something new. It's all, they always sold something new and big at the end of the Nintendo Direct. They always do that. Splatoon 3 was shown, Breath of the Wild 2 was shown in that one. I don't know what, uh, or usually at, or sometimes at the end they just saw a Smash Fighter. That's like the big thing. But yeah, Animal Crossing, New Horizons was shown at like the September one. Yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna show like Kirby at the end. Even at even at the Sonic one. They were, it was all like Sonic stuff. They sold the Sonic at the end. They always sold something big at the end. I forgot. But yeah, this week is fake because they said that Bayonetta 3 will not be at E3. So that's basically it. Goodbye.